As my eyelids began to slide across, or slide closed, the conversation I had with Saika that morning began to replay. In a way, it's almost frustrating. Even if I un don't, if I understand where her desperation is coming from, I can't share in it. The pressure she's under is way different from anything a normal high schooler like me goes through. She didn't just stumble into the school the way I did, so I can't just say I feel things the same way she does. Compared to her, no. Compared to everyone else here, there's no doubt if I can't just I just don't match up. I guess that might explain my own frustration. My dreams or what? What do you want now? Ahem. So I'm sure that you've noticed the killing game has begun, but there's still room for a little laughter. It seems our newest students, already so filled with despair, still have hopes of escape. Heart pounding excitement. Okay. <laughs> Ding dong ming wong. Oh, I can't skip this part. It's 7 a.m. I get it. This is gonna be really annoying every time I have to like just. Can I just skip this entire segment? Good morning, everyone. Get yeah, it's just the same cutscene, isn't it? Ain't that lazy? What should I do today? Free time. Do I not learn anything? Uh. Okay. I guess I just take a shower or whatever automatically, I'm guessing. I don't know. Alright. Uh, map time. Alright, who can I actually talk to? Alright, there are people here. There's someone in that dorm. Toko. <laughs> Should I even bother? Nothing in the gym. Yeah, let's talk to those two girls or whatever. Maybe they have some sort of information I could gather. Why am I going slow all of a sudden? God. Ugh. Okay. Yeah, let's talk to Chihiro. That's your name. I wonder what that teddy bear actually operates. Could it be a robot with an AI installed in it? No, we ha don't have the technology yet. Maybe it's some kind of bear-shaped cyborg from the future. Should I hang out with Chihiro for a while? Nah, she seems rather creepy. So I guess I could really just talk to anyone. This is like the social aspect of the game. Just go around walking around and talking to people. Let me see. Alright. <laughs> I fucking love your hair. It looks like a fucking ice cream cone. Pushing him on doesn't help. Smacking him doesn't help. What the heck? What the, what the heck is up with those yeah. things? Oh, sorry. I'm talking about the metal plates covering all the windows. Ah, I know. We should try grabbing the top and yanking down on it. Alright. Alright, let's... I don't know, is there anyone else that might be interested? Oh yeah, report card, so... My report card with Sayaka... Has been increased or something, right? Info! Skill! Melodious voice. Thing I remember about Makoto most... Okay. And I guess I don't have any information, right, unless I talk to people. What is there I could talk to? I feel like I'm gonna be, like, hanging out with all the girls rather than the guys. I want to do want to associate with Leon, see what's up, but I'm already on a bad start with Mondo here and Byakia. I don't know. Maybe if I get some information on him, I could find shit out. <laughs> Kiyotaka, maybe I want, might want to uh, hang out with him. Uh, I don't know. Chiro may be a little bit interesting. Maybe that if I collab with her, then I could like. I don't know, like... Eh. So this is just weird altogether. <laughs> but I'm not sure. Maybe she's accepting it? I don't know. I mean, it doesn't seem like she has much of a social life, honestly. So maybe she'll just get used to this until either she kills someone or someone kills her. Oh. Nah. I'm never associating myself to Toko. <laughs> Kyoko seems to be like the really smart type of person. So maybe if I talk to her- well then again, she's not really much for our socializing, is she? I'll start small. Let's talk to Ao. Mm, yeah. uh. 
Let's spend some time with Hina. We want to do some stretches with Hina. Oh god, no. Not exercises. No! My one weakness. This was a regret. Uh, I followed Hina's lead and did some elaborate stretching. She is the athletic type, of course. Hina and I grew a little closer today. All right, I could buy presents or something, right? Hmm. Oh man, oh man. What's up? Okay. I'm getting totally fired up. What? How come? <laughs> how come doesn't how come doesn't matter? Now that I'm revved up, I need to get out of here. Let's race. What? Uh, I don't think that's a good idea. Well, I don't I wouldn't stand a chance anyway. Right. Really? Well, I don't mind a solo run. Well, hold on. You seem so excited, Hina. What's your deal? Huh? Hey, are you making fun of me? <laughs> no, I'm just impressed. Really? Okay, someone really needs to censor that mouth, actually. Yeah, very censor the mouth. Those look like balls. Uh, I used to know this one guy. He was always like, Hina, you're like a super spaz. Super spaz? Yeah. yeah, like he'd see me wearing shorts in winter and he'd say stuff like that. But if you lose to the cold like that, it just means you weren't dedicated enough. Wow, you did all that stuff and didn't get sick? You got it all wrong! Getting sick is for the weak! If you're really dedicated, winter means even lighter clothes! It's all part of your training. Training, huh? You know, maybe if I actually stick to her, I could actually build up some of my muscular enhancements as well. So, like, are you the type of guy who gets sick easily? Actually, yeah. Maybe you could tell, teach me some things or two. See? You're soft! You need more training! Okay, I've got the perfect remedy to keep someone like you fit as a fiddle. Huh? Well, what kind of remedy? Yeah. Actually, I do this myself every morning. You just strip down to your waist, then take a dry towel, and start rubbing down your spare skin. What? I call it... I call it... Uh, uh... What do I call it again? <laughs> a way to keep healthy by stripping down and rubbing towel across your skin? Wouldn't that, like, crease your... But I mean, I mean, oil, that's fine because, like, you're giving more friction to your body parts. But if you just have a towel on, that's just gonna, like, heat up. I, I mean, I guess it'll, it'll build some sort of immunity system. And your skin does regenerate. It's, like, the only human body part or body anything that regenerates whatever. Let's take a shot at this towel treatment. Bamboo beatdown yoga. She seems like the tough type, so... <laughs> Yoga? No. Bamboo beatdown? Towel treatment? I don't know, that seems like the closest... Something like that. Is it something like towel treatment? Oh my god, yeah, that's it! Oh my god, her mouth is now... <laughs> Why is she a cat?! Is that like the Japanese thing, or what? I love going out on my apartment balcony, stripping down, feeling the wind in my skin. God, it feels so amazing. I never let a morning pass without getting in a good rub down. Wait, so you went out of your balcony and stripped down? And you were okay with that? <laughs> you should give it a try. If anything, if you haven't gotten your health, you haven't gotten anything. I hate to see you catch a cold or something. Hina's report were updated based on your experience with her. Skilling him softly. <laughs> your maximum number of skill points has increased. Hey, look at you go. Is it nighttime now? After being introduced to the unique sickness prevention method, I went back to my... I should probably do that now. <laughs> I don't know, is that really a good method or is she just making that shit up and... Whoa. There's still lots of time left on the day. I really don't feel like s sitting here, so maybe I'll take a look around. Alright, so there's still some time that I could kill. So I could, I guess, talk to other people if I want to. I imagine with all the conversations I had... Oh, there's Sayaka. I could probably meet her last. I'm not sure how many times we um, talk to people uh, every day. I'm assuming like up to two to three maybe. So either this is going to be the last day or or the last part of the day or... Actually, no, we should definitely go to the... Uh, where's the gift shop or whatever? Yeah, the school store. I mean, I don't have any yen on me, do I? Can I even buy anything? Let me see. Wait, what exactly can I buy? A vending machine. I guess this must be the school store then. But I don't have any money with me, so I don't think I could really do much or anything. 
Japanese Western blend. Seems more like a clustered antique store. Nice! Is that my money? Is that my money count or something? I don't fucking know. I guess if I'm like the curious mind, I get more points the more I like search for things. I'm starving for information from the outside world. Erg. Momo Mono Machine. Let's learn about it first. During your stay here at Hope Speak Academy, you'll find coins scattered throughout the school. These Mono coins are treasures valued by kings and thieves alike. You can use the handy book menu to see how many Mono coins you have. If you put the coin in this machine here, there's a chance you might win a prize. The more coins you use, the better chance you have getting something new. Check the present section. Okay. Let's try give it a shot, I guess. I only have two coins though, so... Repeat percent, zero what? No, let's just put one. I got... I got an item! What is that? Is that some sort of skin smoothizer or something? I guess I have to search them in the uh, present space or something. Those diapers? What are those? What are those? Um, square. I should probably get going. Is it already daytime? Is it already nighttime? Okay, so yeah, seriously, why the present type? Really? Oh, bird seeds. Sprinkle this around outside. Ooh, I could use. Wait, outside and watch the birds come flocking. Except, how do we go outside exactly? Unless it's like a simulated outside. Rose in vitro. A small. Rose, a small rose stored inside a test tube. Good, it's good for both hellos. And farewells. In the language of flowers, a red road means passionate love. Okay, so I could like give those to like someone I want to go out with. Does that also include guys? Alright. There's nothing stopping you from eating it too, I suppose! Okay, so I could eat it if I'm fucking desperately hungry or something. Alright, let's exit. We should really socialize with other people. Um, Alright, so here we got Mondo, Celeste, and that guy. You know, he's a cool guy. Let's try and hang with... Wait, no, no, wait. Wasn't there like one guy I wanted to meet up with, though? No one at the gym. Kitchen. Hang all. So we got the laundry. Boys' bathroom? Should I... Should I meet up at the boys' bathroom? I don't know, let's... Figure out what sticky shenanigans he's up to. Let's talk to him. <laughs> uh... Do I have to use these shit or what? I, it looks, doesn't look like I could use any of them. Okay, let's uh... What's your face again? Seems like... I don't know why, but I've got the feeling I'm even more stressed out than usual. That's bad, right? You think I might be getting sick? Huh? Hey! Whoever's in charge around here, I'm sick! Get me a doctor! Leon! I got a perfect friend you for you. I, there's a girl named Al, and she could probably shape you into shape. Uh, yeah. Please, get me out of here, please. Yeah, let's spend some time with Leon. Hey. Alright, we gotta sit down and plan out our strategy. You know what I mean. So, Makoto, which girl do you have your eyes on? Leon and I had a strategy meeting. Leon and I grew a little closer today. What does that give him a present? Bird seeds? I don't think he could be the type of person who likes bird seeds. Huh. Uh. I don't even. I'm not even afraid anymore. Now I'm just pissed off. Why? Why is this happening to me? This isn't fair, man. I mean, am I wrong? Oh, um, yeah, it really isn't. Right? Totally unfair. Ultra fair. Oh, un unfair. Just like having to shave my head right before every baseball game. Well, I mean, you choose to do that, right? Come out, man. Are you against me now, too? I didn't even want to play, but the coach and all told to beg me that, so I did. And then they made me shave my head just because it's tradition. How's that fair? Damn straight I do. Who has fun around running around on a dusty field for three hours? But for baseball players, the field is a sacred ground, isn't it? Was not... But so not cool. Spending all the time getting practice, getting covered hey, in sun and dirt. It's just baseball, right? It's easy. Who needs practice? 
I think the gods picked the wrong person to bless with that much talent. Oh, yeah? Still, I gotta admit, baseball wasn't all bad. It did have a few things going for it. Yeah, right, like... Yeah, right, like the feeling of camaraderies between you and your teammates. Seriously? Nah, nothing like that. I can't... Uh, ooh, I can't stand being around a bunch of sweaty guys. So uncool. Yeah, what do you like about it? Well, I hate studying, right? But I still got into this super fancy school on a sports scholarship. As long as I kept playing, I never had to study. And besides that, it made me super popular with ladies. Booyah, you're jealous? I got the third... I got to third base in more than one, if you know what I'm saying. Just kidding. You're not that fucking... You're not fucking Sayaka. Please never do that again, alright? That's really annoying. <laughs> <laughs> I got plenty more where that come from. I'll tell you what next time. Anyways, let's hang out again sometime soon. Talk to you, Talking to you keeps my head and off this mind. Lily on his face, uh, okay. I'm not really sure why, but I guess Leon likes hanging out with me. Leon's report card has been updated based on your experience with him. You just unlocked the skill, Robot Jock. Give yourself a pound back, you've earned it. So how exactly do I earn money? Once we are done, we'll head back to my room for a little while. Is it night time yet? Or do I have one more thing to do? Shit, it's night time, so okay. Only twice per day from what I'm seeing. Unless it's like a story specific thing. So, so far all this game's doing right now is just letting you relax and doing shit. Okay. Third day has already come to an end. When will I... No. Well, we... When are we gonna get out of here? That's the number one question. I laid on my bed and start blink stared blankly at the ceiling. Before I knew it, I'd fall into an uneasy... Here we go again with the Monokuma Theater! Very low budget indeed. I need an immediate fast acting pick-me-up. If it doesn't act now, it's the same as giving it a regret. What do you think guides the world? Speed, of course. That's the Formula 1. So, okay, any idiot can accomplish anything if they take it slow. Even a human... Okay. Someone who does things in timely fashion in both ways. Straight is better. Is, are these any, um... Information drive through is better than sit down. A Sunday comic artist is smarter than a graphic novelist. What am I saying? Speed is the gold standard of the standard Which is world. Why I said I need that pick me up. Meanwhile, 0 0.002 seconds later. I don't get it. I really don't get it. I don't get what's going on here. I guess that acts as a separate day or something, unless this is like story based right now. Good morning, everyone. Get ready to greet another bee. Okay. I woke up with the irritating sound of Monokuma's voice. I slowly pulled myself out of bed. Yeah. <sighs> another night of restless sleep. Day after day, I can feel the fatigue pulling up, piling up. As soon as I thought had, as soon as the thought had crossed my mind. Ding dong. Sounds like the doorbell forces way to my dorm. We'll be right back. Finally, some sort of story. Alright, be right back. Oh, fuck. I... Mm, damn it. <laughs> Hold on, I might have to reset this. So, be right back again. <laughs> 